Hi guys, I was uh, sitting in on a podcast, we started recording podcasts um, about a month ago, and we were on our second or third one, and having a, a conversation with a, a lovely lady around um, market research and how she's developed a product in the space, and um, what the technology challenges might be. Um, in the end, I learned something very interesting around what market research can be. So. When we're pushing out market research to the marketplace, um, and I think this is really clear for a lot of you, that we may send a, a market survey. Um, you get these in your inbox and say, please answer these 10 questions that are not very interesting and uh, we'd love to get your feedback. So it's something that we've all been engaged with. And a key pivotal thing that came out of the podcast was when you're sending out some market research, you need to know your customer who they are and engage them during the process. It's a, it's a sales process. So you're looking to get them into the market research as if you were looking to engage them as a client. So I really got a good insight out of that and it's a how are we making market research fun. Um, it drew some awareness as to some of the products that we're uh, rolling out in Arion um, and it's generally something an afterthought that when you look at market research, it's just something that you might do to get some feedback. But when you really pull it apart, if you're looking to get great feedback from people, then generally we're gonna to have to one, engage them, two, connect with them as a client, um, draw, their in, draw them in. So basically, if you're looking to engage with um, someone aged between the brackets of 30 to 40 that's working a nine to five job, um, we probably don't wanna send them a market research piece at 9 a.m. in the morning. Maybe we consider sending them something at uh, 5.36 o'clock when they're on the train ride home and basically say, hey, hey, just uh, reaching out, you're probably catching the train home after a long busy day at work. I want to basically quickly ask you a couple of questions and see how we can better serve you as a customer. One, you've actually connected with your customer um, and two, you're probably likely to convert them more into a survey than not. So uh, it was really good insight in terms of um, how we can use technology uh, to better serve us and to better add value to our customers. I just wanted to share that. Uh, we'll be sharing out the podcast in a couple of weeks. So jump on and have a listen when it hits um, uh, from a podcast perspective. But yeah, really good little insight. Um, take a step back, not just ask a survey, know who you're surveying, look at how you engage them from not only just a question and answer perspective, also how you're engaging them from a, an emotional perspective. Because in the end, we're dealing with real people, our real customers, and we're trying to get real feedback to actually better serve them. And it's not just about us. So it's all about our customer and how we can add more value. So uh, if you want to ask questions to your customers, just a quick tip that came out of that podcast, ask them in a way that's going to serve them and they're going to want to actually share their, their insights and their feedback with your business. Thanks, guys. Hope it's a great tip for you.